Hello and welcome to another Ultra Game Template tutorial. In this tutorial, what we're going to do is we're going to extend the footstep system and the first of all, we're going to make our third person to use a, a UGT's custom uh, footstep system, okay? And then we're going to create a water surface so we can play different footstep zones, okay? So the first part is actually super easy if you want it, her to play uh, footsteps. And you can do that in anything that has a, an animation. So we go to characters, mannequin, and it's rigged to the UE4, uh, UE5 mannequin, sorry. We go to mannequins, and we go to animations, and we go to queen. And I'm just going to do that in uh, in queen's uh, rune forward animation, okay? But you could really do that in any other one that you want. So we have now the rune forward animation. And here, what we're going to do we're going to open the asset and in the notify we're going to add a new track and we're going to add a new notify track and what are we going to do in this track so we're going to go here in the first air and we're going to add a new notify in the second track of the kind ugt footstep notify so we add the first one and now we are just going to right click copy and then we will go here and then we will paste it doesn't have to, to be super precise really we're going to paste it here. We are going to paste it here. We are also going to paste it here. And we are going to paste that to here. Okay. So now, right, we're going to click right fit. Uh, this right, we're going to click here below. It's, it, it's under my cam, but well, you, you will see right feed. And for the feed that, that is the right feed, we should click right feed here also. And I think uh, that's it. Okay. So what we're going to do now is we're going to open the blueprint UGT footstep notify. We're going to open the blueprint. And you will eventually see over here a line trace and the router book line type. We're going to set for duration and just for testing purposes okay we're going to open the ugt play footstep zone okay double click and we're going to make a ball multiplier of four so we can listen to the footstep sound okay so as you can see now our mannequin should be playing footsteps and here we go we do a trace to the floor from the hips to the feet you could choose where do you want the hip to be made in the footstep blueprint okay but we are playing footsteps fantastic how do we now play another kind of footstep and if you uh, take a look at this blueprint what we are doing essentially is feeding to the uh, ugt play footstep zone we're feeding the physics material okay so now we can uh, do certain things with the physical material and I don't provide with you the new physical material because to create those, you really need to change the .ini files of your project. And I don't really want to do that. So let's go to edit, project settings, and let's do that. And here in project, we are going to search in the search bar surface. Okay. And aside from default, we are going to put here water. Fantastic. And now, if we... Uh, with this note over here and we again make a switch from here now we have default and water but instead of using this like that what we're going to do is the zone we're going to make a select here we're going to select an physical surface uh, this is a physical surface okay we're going to do a select on a physical surface and if we make new physical surfaces uh, we should just change the sound here so we have this here and for the foul we're going to select q and we're going to have the concrete footsteps and for the water we're going to import new songs that i'm uh, giving to you for free on the description so we are going to go in this folder i'm going to click import and uh, you should extract the dot uh, dot zip and extract these songs and now you have water songs Remembering the water sounds, okay, I'm just going to do this in batch. So I'm going to go to Asset Actions, Edit Selection in Property Matrix. I'm going to search for Class here. And Class, I'm going to select UGT FX, okay. Fantastic. 
and what we are going to do is I'm going to select the first step. It doesn't really matter. I'm going to create a queue and I'm going to name it steps queue with the zero one. I'm going to open this queue now. I'm going to delete this and I'm going to select this four with the shift and I'm going to select random multiple WAPs. And essentially what we are doing is an audio plane that plays a random water sound. Fantastic. And now we select this in the content browser and we add this to the water here. And now we have footsteps for water and concrete. But okay, how do you how do I say to, to something that hey, this is a water? So that's a little bit more complicated. So what we could do is for example, we could have this box over here. Okay. And let's put this box here. And let's just select this box over here. Let's go to this folder. And let's put this here. And I want this to sound as water. So it's really easy. What I need to do, uh, let me go back to my folder. Let me go back to my third person folder and we're going to create a new and then we're going to find here ph and we're going to search for for a new physical material okay and it is should extend physical material we are going to click select and we are going to click uh, ugt water and that's it okay and now that we have that the only thing we need to do is we need, we have to open this and in the surface tape, instead of default, we're going to select water. Fantastic. Uh, so what do we have now? Now, here in this model, we can select here, physical material override, okay? And we are going to select UGT water and surprise, surprise, my water footsteps should be working. Why aren't they working? Let's save everything. And I think this should do it. Let's see. No, and my footsteps are neither working. Something is happening with the footstep. So we have to notify. This sounds correct. This sounds correct. Oh, okay, I have not connected this. My bad. I'm sorry. Let's or tidy this a little bit. Save. Okay. And let's go. Now we have water. Okay, but what if I want the player to be able to uh, put the, the fits inside the water? It's super easy. We should go just in this model and collision presets. We set them to custom. Okay, and we ignore everything but visibility and camera. But if we do this, because of the way of the foot traces are happening, it is actually ignoring and she's trolling in the water. The problem is if we say, hey, I don't want to trace visibility. The problem is it won't trace the surface of the model. So very easy solution. Okay. What we can do is in the footstep notify. If you are having this problem with third person, the trace channel instead of visibility, we can trace for camera. And that's it. And now the feet stay in the water and the footstep sounds are playing okay uh but what if instead of that i because now if i put this material over here okay this thing is not going to sound as water so instead of that what we can do is we can open any material okay and the physical material we're just going to say oh gt water and that's actually it now i have material assigned to the water footsteps forever okay so that's how you can make footsteps little tutorial and new footsteps so see you in the next one